second day in Portugal and I forgot to open the vlog yesterday. So we're gonna rewind and come right back to this moment in like 10 minutes. So sorry, I hate when people do this, but let's go. You don't wanna miss it, okay? <laughs> I'm showing my mom. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, did, did your mom, was he your mom in the car? Um. so much like a boy. I cannot believe I'm really importable. Oh my God. What about earlier? Oh, look at the guy that tried to sell me weed. Who? The guys over there. Oh, damn. The, the, the guy smoking a cigarette over there. He came to me and was like, <laughs> and see if I can find something to wear. Mm -hmm. It's a speaker. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this top is actually really cute. I like this. I hope it looks as good on camera as it is in person, but it's so cute. Look at this. Definitely getting this top. Okay, this one I think I'm gonna get. I wish the color would show up good on camera. The camera is not doing this justice. This is cute. So I'm gonna get this for sure. And this. So we have found some winners. Okay, is that quick? Cause now we're back to where we're starting, okay? Look at that, that was quick. Anyways, look at all this stuff I got. I got a hemp protein bar, y'all. So I'm gonna experiment and I hope this works out for me. Look at this. 
He said it's supposed to give you like calmness, but it won't get you super hot, just like mellow. Well, let's see. Okay, so a really cute thing about this hotel is that you have free breakfast but they don't fix it for you. They just provide you with everything you need to make breakfast. So let me show you real quick. So right here, they provide you with like a bag of fresh, fresh bread every day. Let me look in here. Oops. Yeah, this is like bread. Yeah, like croissants and things. And I think a muffin is in here, but they deliver this. We'll fix that in a second. They deliver this to your door every day. And then up here, you have all types of, you know, different flavored jam to put on it if you wish. And then, what is this, cereal. Then you have granola with strawberries because we have yogurt in the refrigerator. Honey, espresso cups if you want to make you a little espresso shot or some coffee. And let me show you. So in our refrigerator, we have eggs milk which none of us drink dairy and then you have your fresh fruit down here your yogurt cups with like butter so that is what you that's what you have if you want to fix breakfast so when they say free breakfast they're like yeah we're gonna provide you with the food love but the rest is on you which i get you know not every country does it the same and then you have all the utensils you need right here so you have like forks and everything and then for you to wash the dishes you have little um what is it? What you put in the dishwasher? I look so washed out. But yes, I'm actually about to eat. I went to go pick me up some breakfast. So I did not join them when they just went because um, I got some soup. Some type of soup. This is like their spinach and rice soup, which I actually, I'm excited to try. Let me go ahead and see what this is hitting on. And I don't have to warm it up because it's already, you know what I mean? It's already warm. It's already good. Okay, the lighting. The lighting probably looks a bit bright. Sorry, y'all. It's better this way than the other way. Oh, it's filled. Do you have any napkins? Yikes. They filled it to the very top, which I have no complaints about because that means the more you get, you know. It's good. It's good. It's kind of making me a little mad, I ain't gonna lie. Because I've never had anything that's good in the US. I love Lisbon so far. Very, very different from Barcelona and Paris. It's a different vibe. That is the word. It's a different vibe. The vibe is different. Like that's, that's exactly what it is. But the vibe is amazing, I love it. I'm thankful like that I'm able to experience life outside of the U, or like able to experience places outside of the u.s i love the u.s of course that's like my home but then you go other places and you realize there's so much more to life the food is better the people are sometimes nicer um and just the experience is like you're like dang i'm so glad i spent the money booked the trip and just said i'm just gonna do it and worry about it later because these trips of course oh my god i just went to spain last month and now I'm back in Europe in Portugal. And it, it adds up, it adds up. But at the end of the day, it's like the money comes back, the experiences don't. Why not? Why not travel? Why not just travel? Cause I would spend the money on something else ridiculous probably, like who knows. I'm gonna eat and then come back to you. Oh, this is, I gotta finish this because me talking is getting cold and it's like, okay, okay. I'm not cold.
Okay. Anyways, so we're about to get ready to go. Got this picture yesterday from a local artist, and this is so cute. It's gonna go in the bathroom on like the bookshelf. Really nice. Like this is the best piece of art ever. So this, are you waiting on me? Okay, I'm gonna go. Okay, so I took go get some coffee and some food because as you saw, the espresso machine was not working for me. And yeah. This is what I was trying to make this morning in the machine and it did not work out. <laughs> So I went back to the place yesterday that I got the soup at and I got some more because it was so good. Just the way to my hotel, y'all, I'm really just walking. I know it's literally a mess right now. It's been a rough couple of days, okay? But I forgot to take my um, seed probiotics and I don't have any water in here to take it with because I drank all of it last night. So I'm about to take it with coffee, which probably isn't the smartest, but you gotta do what you gotta do, you know, you know. This pill is huge. Anyways, I have my food let out, y'all, because I'm about to pick out. About to pick out. I hope I have a lot of footage for this <laughs> vlog. Because we're only here for three days, and today is our last full day. Tomorrow we leave early in the morning. However, a family member is coming from Nigeria today. So we're not, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to hang with them super long which is my first time meeting them, so I'm kind of sad, but you know, hope, I mean, at least I get to see them for the first time in person. Okay, so correction, yesterday and today I said this was soup. This is not soup, this is called, damn, I should've listened when she said the name. Something with a G, but it's not soup. They don't consider this to be soup. Although in America, this will be considered a soup because it's liquidy, you know, it's like a liquidy food. Um, and it's just rice and spinach. And it's like a, a healthy food for sure, but it's not soup. So good. So, so, so good. Like I'm going to miss this. In Spain, in Barcelona, what I miss the most is, are their pastries. Their pastries are phenomenal. Like I don't think no country that I've been to can match Barcelona. Well, Spain snacks. Like their pastries were just delicious. Like, I've been looking in Portugal for something similar. But, of course, you know, different countries have different things. But nothing could match the pastries that I had in Barcelona. 
nothing. And now nothing can match this. Like I'm pretty sure I'll never be able to get anything this good anywhere else. And although it just is rice and spinach, the like the seasonings that they have in here are delicious. So I don't know. I tried to go this morning for breakfast. Well, yeah, we tried to go this morning for breakfast and get it, but they didn't open till 10, so we went somewhere else for breakfast. And I think because I was craving this, I did not. <laughs> I didn't like my breakfast because I was craving this. Isn't that so, like, who do I think I am? I have this on. I know it looks tacky, but it's so cold. Portugal is right by the Atlantic Ocean, so it's on, like, the outskirts of Europe. I'm not the outskirts, but it's on, like, the edge. It's not, like, in the middle or whatever. It's on the edge, so... The breeze from like the the water, the ocean, at night it gets incredibly cold, and during the day it's chilly. Like it's summer right now. It's it's the sun is shining, you know, full blast outside. But you have to have something on. Even people walking around have on coats and jackets because the wind does not play with you. <laughs> it does not. Okay, so I just changed into a hoodie. I'm actually so scared. I don't know if I should upload my footage to my computer right now because my camera is scaring me don't know if it's gonna you know work properly but i don't feel like i have time um so the family member that i was mentioning earlier has just arrived so they came back to get something and then just left back out to go get him from the airport so while they're doing that i need to go ahead and go to h&m and then go to like the their their version of walgreens slash cvs and get something and then come right back. So let's head out and do that. My lips are so dry. One thing I do not like is dry lips. Like my lips are too big. The lighting is like really good. <laughs> it's looking real cute, real good like. All right. I really wish my mom could have came like my mom is the best person to travel with because she's open to trying any and everything. Like, I love my mom so much. I wish she could have came. I'm probably gonna put y'all up until I get to H&M because I don't wanna hold the camera and walk because, I mean, it's a broken record at this point, but you've heard me say my camera isn't working properly, so we'll see. Okay, I do wanna see how far away H&M is. I hope it's walking distance. I believe it is walking distance. Let's see, it's 300 feet away. Can you see this? So it is exactly a three minute walk to H&M from our hotel. So let's go ahead and head out. Okay, so I tried this dress on. I did not think I was gonna like it, but I do. I had got it in the shirt as well, cause I was thinking I was gonna like the shirt more than the dress, but I actually really like the dress. I might get both if the shirt looks good. How are we gonna get this? And I think it's like $40, so that sucks, but. So I'm at this shop, Mix, Mixerica Creative Gifts, and this vase right here. I really want to get my mom. I think it's so cute. Well, it's not a vase, whatever it is. I want to get it for my mom. But it's closed. These pictures are so cute. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh, this one or that one? But it's closed. Gotta go home and get ready. I think they're already leaving the airport. Is my hotel on the street? It is, okay. All right. I ended up getting the dress. Funny story, the one I tried on, when I took it off, it broke. <laughs> and thank God they had an extra, they had another extra small. Because the shirt was not cute on. And the thing I like about vlogging in other countries is nobody stares at you. Nobody literally gives a crap what you did. Just stay out of their way. <laughs> Versus the US, they'd be like this.
about random things and caught up highly highly recommend portugal to anyone who's thinking about going book the flight just go worry about it later but thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you in my next vlog